Hi, it's Julie. Welcome to my channel. I am Scrap and Happy. I want to show you a quick flip through of my March design team project for Elsie Bell's bookshelf. I used the Nature's Record digital kit and uh, I think it is fabulous. It's eight and a half by five and a half, 52 pages. The cover is um, a cut up uh, duffel bag, which I thought was kind of perfect for an outdoor little journal. It's kind of like a field notes kind of thing. Uh, I don't know, it's, it's a really cool kit. Um, a lot of things, most everything in here came from Elsie Bell's bookshelf, but not all. This did not. Just a big old tag with pocket and all. Oh, and you know what? This page, it's uh, two page, two pieces of cardstock glued together um, with Tyvek in between and then covered with a duffel bag and then a piece of paper. This is a, um, a mop-up page or a spray page that is underneath other things I'm spraying. And I thought it was just, oh, you can't see that side. I thought it was really pretty. The colors were great for this. So anyway, I was really excited to get to use that. Anyway, here, it, here we go, here's the kit. And the back side um, is a page out of The Big Deal from Avalon Rose. Pocket from the kit. This. This. And this. All from the kit. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I wasn't... This envelope just has writing paper inside, and I put a couple pieces of ledger paper and some uh, grid paper because, in my mind, this book I can just see somebody not me because I don't do outdoors, but I can just see somebody traipsing through the woods or you know, some gorgeous place and you know, looking at specimens and writing things down. <laughs> um, and I added a couple of pages from. I think this is called Remembrance, and I'm pretty sure it was from Deli Girl, um, though I'm not certain, but it is one of my all-time favorite uh, digital kits uh, with the poppies and the outdoor-y look and stuff, which I thought this journal has so much green that I wanted to add in some, you know, contrasting colors, so um, I did that. Uh, anyway, here's some grid paper. Another one of my cards that I uh, painted and then stamped on. Uh, you can't read it, but it's Those Who Look for Beauty Find It. And I thought that was really cool to go with this page. If you truly love nature, you will find beauty everywhere. And then three more journal tags. This bird came from, um, it was a, f a freebie download, but I can't remember where I got it. Um, I'm really sorry about that. You know, I wasn't going to ever forget, so, hmm. Anyway, three more uh, journaling cards, including this big, tall one. this kit and I love these pages and with it these are from the kit look at this one I love this things to do today or sketch wildflowers lay in a field and breathe of course if I was laying in a field with fresh grass and etc I would not be able to breathe but it's a lovely idea anyway <laughs> some more journaling cards I 
I tried to put three in each pocket. There were a ton of journaling cards in this kit. Um, and I was able to even use some of them as pockets. There were plenty. And another envelope that has uh, writing paper in it. Three more tags. Oops. These two from the kit, and this one is one of my uh, one of my painted ones. And in the very back, I have um, a bag. I got these from Selena at Amore Fabrics. Uh, they're just fabulous. They're just so pretty and outdoorsy and springy and happy. And, and this little bunny, um, I cut things out of uh, Pier 1 Imports sales papers or um, no, whatever. You know, they come in the mail. They're like little tiny catalog-y type things. Um, and they have, they have the coolest things. And I always find something really cute to cut out and put in put in somewhere. So I thought that little bunny would probably be prancing through the forest. So anyway, that is it. And I left the strings along uh, to do whatever with. And this is for a friend of mine. And she's a very earthy girl. And I thought this was perfect. So I'll be sending that to her uh, in the next day or two. And I hope she likes it. And I hope that you enjoyed the flip through. Thanks a lot. Y'all have a good day.